Okay, YouTubers, I've decided after many years to start doing uh, YouTube videos on Minecraft. Uh, this particularly uh, has been a. I don't know. It's, it's been a long time coming, I think. Um, basically, I'm going to show you um, one of my maps. Um, gonna load in now and I'm going to do a series on cities and if anybody wants to comment uh, below um, how to make certain things uh, redstone wiring um, even schematics I can uh, put them in downloads if people want and um, with any further ado, uh, here we go. So, <clears throat> I suppose the uh, best way to start is um, when I first started this world. Um, this was my original spawn point. So, this is where I decided to um, start building, as you can see. Um, the house is very basic and um, I started basically adding to the area try and flatten it out a bit <coughs> um, not much to say really um, after I start building the house, I started um, building cities. Great on larger scales. Um, various ways you can get to my cities. Um, I will add that this is an incomplete map. I will eventually have it as an adventure map or just basically for you to explore <coughs> and um, where do we go first right so let's do it in um, order from where I first began so I built this little homestead here and then decided to create a city <coughs> so I decided to create Castle City first named for its obvious reasons that there is a castle like building and it's quite fortified um, started building the castle it was really bad um, used the lay of the land haven't really changed much I just built into it um, then I decided to build this little shopping precinct <coughs> Then I got a little bit more creative and built the city wall all the way around. <coughs> With various things underneath it and another, oh dear, another little shopping precinct. The roof originally was filled with water, but um, when the um, snow biome decided to start changing um, can't remember what release that was but it did change and the biomes got mixed up and part of this it decided to be a snow biome so hence the snow um, 
then after creating that little area there I decided to create well a mine so then another portal then as time progressed I started getting a bit more comfortable with how Minecraft works um, give you one of my first goes at a sort of redstone device pressure plate and push button and pressure plate on time in set on pressure plate that goes through and you've got to do that which way is it? that way it first there we go then do that um, I learned that pretty quickly um, the castle nothing really in the castle um, built sort of like a jail cell somebody in there um, like most of my cities um, the are unfinished I will be coming back to them eventually and polishing them up a little bit more um, but I do like the rustic feel of that it was my first achieved city basically so um, what what can I really say about it it's um, Every, every single city that I um, make will always have hidden doorways and treasure and ooh, diamonds, coal, diamonds, diamonds. So if it is going to be a survival map, um, then obviously there's material and if it's going to be a bench map uh, I will eventually uh, turn it into an adventure <coughs> but it's pretty good I mean I have returned to this city a few times to like polish it up a little bit as a go, you know, just add certain things, that's the floor to a church above, um, a little underground bazaar, that says mine, as in mine, not mine, I mean mine as in mining, um, like the mining ship Red Dwarf, but anyway, <laughs> so yeah, there's plenty of um, hidden places. Um, this um, was actually inspired by the, there is quite a few um, techniques or buildings. Um, that are inspired by either other games um, cross platform um, 360 um, Nintendo um, PlayStation various things um, but like I said um, there is a lot of hidden things I mean under this tower uh, there is a long way down but when you get to the bottom if you wish to um, actually do it there is a worship room with dun 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 ender dragon eggs I will point out that most of this map, this world, has been done by hand. Um, started out in um, survival, then changed it to creative because it was taking a, a lot of my time up. 
Um, so a lot of it has been done in creative by myself, nobody helping. Um, there is a few structures that I did try MC Edit with, um, and because it would take a hell of a lot of time um, using just creative mode. So um, stuff like End Dragon that was um, when I first got into Minecraft. I tried a few mods out, and I think that was on too many items mod. You could have the End of Dragon X. Um, but generally everything that I have built or you see in front of you um, is actually built by myself in creative mo well most of this was in survival actually but um, this building was creative mode and everything else outside of the city thereafter was creative mode as well um, should I say it is <coughs> But well, um, as you could tell from my um, redstone little doorway before with the sticky pistons and that, um, I actually um, got a little bit more better with redstone and created contraptions like this. And obviously, if you Um, basically I uh, scanned quite a lot of YouTube videos um, for redstone um, contraptions and then modify them to my own um, and this is one of them this is um, Holy Tower with um, defense built in. So um, let's have a look. Let's just stick 32 in each, shall we? Just so you get a better, just so you get a, a feel of it. Do apologize. Um, as you can tell, this is my first ever video of um, Minecraft, so you will have to bear with me. And um, like I said, I am going to be doing series, um, hopefully, um, cities. And um, like I said before, if anybody wishes to um, comment below, comment below. Um, if not, then just feel free to watch the video and tell your friends, family, anybody else who plays Minecraft um, to have a look if they like what they see then maybe they can comment. <laughs> uh, I know I talk a lot but I feel if I don't talk a lot then it's just going to be silence. So, um, I mean, this is pretty good. You could use it um, on a PvP, I suppose. Um, and, you know, you could um, have somebody spawning in another city, um, gathering the defences, then coming to raid your city. And,. Um, This would make a pretty uh, good defense, um, at least on this side of the city. You might have to adapt um, the other sides just so you could um, defend. <laughs> so yeah, just I do apologize for the length of time it is taking me. <laughs> so yeah. So basically when all of the dispensers are filled up, 
I won't actually go into too much detail of how it works, but if anybody is interested, I will try and remember how I did it, then um, do a tutorial. But um, basically, what you'll get is if you follow this, um, click switch. Basically, got a defense tower on all four sides that will stop your enemies. As you can see, you get pretty much peppered if you add it on full all the way from over there. Probably show you. Let's have a look. Let's just fly back up again. Did this and go. So yeah. And jump down quickly. This is the sort of thing you can get in on all four sides. So you're going to... Not much of a defence, but if all four dispensers on each side are filled up um, with 64 stack in each segment of the dispenser, then, you know, I'm not going to do the maths. I can't be bothered. I'm too tired. It's too um, late in night to be doing maths like that but you'll have a hell of a lot of um, arrows firing down at you so yeah that's the um, Trinity Tower uh, the Holy Tower um, this is on the outside of the city um, As you can tell, that was one of my earlier attempts at. Um, there you go. <laughs> Redstone. Um, yeah. Um, each city or town has got its own. Well, mine station, train station, um, underground train station, obviously. Um, but that'll be another video I should imagine but yeah it's deep underground and uh, like I said most places in the city are um, named I have no idea why I've put asylum work but there you go uh, okay As you can tell, there is slight hints to either film trivia or game trivia. Obviously, Croft Place is a reference to um, Lava Croft, Tomb Raider. Um, Port Street, obviously, that's to do with portals. Um, this was when I was trying to work out um, specific never portals, um, where to place them for you to um, teleport into the real world users like sort of quick teleporting rather than you know teleporting using um, command keys okay um, I've got oh yeah flying ship up there I think that's actually got another portal on top as well aren't it? really long way away um, yeah I extended um, the castle out of ground sort of thing to accommodate a sort of little docking area or a little ship that was one of the first attempts of a ship um, each city well this city in particular anyway has got um, a north east 
southwest gate and each one of them has a shop that be that shop that shop uh, that shop there and that shop right there down that way um, yeah so that were observation tower that was my idea of um, trying to use elevator looks pretty good and it's pretty effective actually uh, I mean as long as you um, stay to the side, I mean it's pretty slow going up obviously if you on creative it's faster but you do eventually get up um. so yeah that is my first city and homestead. Um,